Good afternoon, guys. Just wanted to do a quick video on my um, Vito Pro Pack MB bag. Um, I keep my meter in this and just a few things for electrical diagnosis and things like that. A lot of my tools for a service call, I keep in my TP4 pouch that I already made a video on, but I just want to show you guys what I keep in here. And real quick, and I want to, um, I'm going to be adding to this eventually at some point too. Adding some more, but right now you, you got the nice front pouch here. I don't even keep anything in it right now. I was keeping my jumpers in there, but I find it easier to have them clipped onto here. I, don't know, I just find it easier. A little bit of electric tape, not much. And I keep these w automatic wire strippers. These are Kleins. These are real nice. Probably one of the best tools I've ever bought in the last year or so. I use these all the time and they work awesome. Definitely a good investment. If you guys want to strip wire is good and clean and quickly. Um, just keep a couple Weeha insulated screwdrivers. You know, just a Phillips and a flathead. Basic stuff. I keep a little carabiner clip on here that I will clip to the side of my TP4 pouch. I'm carrying them both or going up to a roof or something, but I also do have the shoulder strap for this as well. Going up ladders and everything. The front here, just keep my meter in it. This is my old one, a UEI DL379. This thing served me well for many years, but it's time for a new one. You can see the amp probe, I dropped it and it broke and the metal's exposed right there. So it does not read amps properly anymore. And then I just have the nice uh, fluke, fluke test leads with it. Shorted that one out. You can see, because I didn't have this up. Also has the insulation, you can wind in and out on it. Pretty cool, but I didn't and I shorted it out one day. So what happens, it happens to the best of us. Then just inside, I just keep a couple of things here. Bunch of wire ties. Always use those. Um, my old, my old wire crimpers, if they'll come out. Old pair of channel lock pair. They still work great. But I recently got some new south wire ones. These things are beat. I have had these for ever. And then just a pair of linesmen's, Klein linesmen's. And then, Keep my little box here. Got my box of goodies. Put this right here. Just all the basic stuff you'd need. A quick service call so you don't have to run back to the truck. Just wire nuts, screws, caps, stake ons, everything. Just, just all that random stuff you'd need and you, when you don't want to run back to the truck off the roof for like one wire nut because it's just a pain in the ass. But this is the bag here. I love it. I'm thinking about getting an MB2 though, just to have a little more room. But these things can hold a lot, like I said. They can hold a lot more than what I have in it, and they're awesome bags. Like I said, I clip it up there on the TP4. You can see that, sort of. Sorry, I'm doing this off my phone, guys. Like when I'm going to a roof or something, so I just got them both together and bring them up. But um, yeah, that's it. So, uh, so I'm gonna give you guys a quick review of it. Nothing inside there. A couple little pieces of wire and that's it. But um, thank you for watching guys and uh, stay tuned for more. Just to also add, I forgot about this. The um, They come with a nice carry handle too. You see that and it can detach. It can detach as well. It's really nice and sturdy. Like I said, I got the strap. This is a strap that's sold separately though. This does not come with a strap, but I added it as well just in case I wanted to take in this bag you know sometimes it's easier to sling things over your shoulder especially going up a ladder and whatever unless I you know I'm clipping it to my TP4 over here but I just want to uh, show you guys that too the TP4 comes with like the same handle as well you can see it there how it's connected and I also got a shoulder strap on that one yeah I just wanted to add at the end of this video guys that um this veto stuff is real good these Vito Pro Packs, I, I've seen them for years and I didn't end up buying anything till like last summer. And I got three of them. I got the Tech MCT2, 
um, and I'll uh, I'll put a review up of that if anyone's interested too. Um, but these things they're gonna last forever. I've been through so many bags and pouches and boxes in my time. I said I've been doing this for 20 years, but um, I'm very impressed by these, and they're really good. So and I will be investing in more. So I just wanted to add that to the end of this real quick. Thanks for watching, guys.